So today is August 16th, and yesterday Kabul fell to the Taliban, and basically Afghanistan as a whole is now in Taliban control. The American embassy is in the process of being evacuated, and the country is basically descending into chaos. I got a lot of mixed feelings about it. Obviously I'm a veteran, I served in the US Army, and I served in Afghanistan for all of 2006. I think of all of the effort, all of the lives lost. We were, we were lucky enough that we didn't lose anybody from our unit in Afghanistan. We had several people get injured. I got blown up in Afghanistan. We had a suicide bomb hit my truck. All of the other people that have served in you know the 20 years that we were in that country, and it basically was wiped away in a month. I'm not really mad at our political leaders for it. Realistically, we probably should have been out of Afghanistan 15 years ago. The writing was has been on the wall for a very long time. It was very obvious that this was probably going to happen in Afghanistan. It was just gonna happen whenever we left. If we were gonna go in and root out Al-Qaeda, we should have done that and then get the hell out, but we didn't. And we spent the last 20 years trying to instill democracy into a country that had neither the will nor the capacity for it. You know, it's another instance of outsiders came in and created the country of Afghanistan without paying attention to the demographic differences within the country. And this is what you got. Trying to instill a national identity in 20 years when they've had a tribal identity for the thousand plus years before that was not gonna work. But damn, we tried. It's just, it's a very sad and unfortunate situation because there's going to be a lot of suffering. Unfortunately, the reality of it was it was never going to work because the only reason it was being held together was by us. I'm sad about it because in a lot of ways it ends up feeling like a wasted effort. Afghanistan's been going on since I was 17. Now it's just, it was all for nothing, essentially. You know, I'm proud of my service, I'm proud of what we did there, but then you look at it and realize that as a whole, the country's just imploded again. It's a sad day. The withdrawal could have been handled better. I think the reason things went to shit so quickly was because we kind of rushed it. If it had been a more gradual withdrawal, that would have been probably more effective. And we probably, we should have had more time to get our allies out of the country. But instead, we got out of the country as quick as we could. So, I don't know. It's just, it's very bitter. I'm just very bitter about it, to be honest. Like, you have all the work that you did, you know. All the sacrifices, blood, sweat, and tears, and a lot of money, and just nothing. You, you accomplished nothing. So, there's my, there's my rant. There's my two cents as an Afghanistan war veteran. That's, that's my feeling on it. It was, it was an unwinnable situation that we probably should have been out of 10 years ago, 15 years ago, and we finally got out of it now, and we saw exactly where it was going.